Hey guys, it's Nate, aka The Foot Accountant. Welcome back to the channel. You know what time it is. Time for some packs. We got more upgrade SBCs this week. We didn't get the ones that I thought we were going to get. I thought we were going to get the uh, upgrade SBCs by league, those same ones that we had been getting every single week when the respective league team of the season would come out. I thought they were going to release all those at one time. But they went a different route. They wanted to give us a chance to pack some of the other team of the season cards as well. This ultimately is better for EA because, you know, we have a lesser chance of packing an ultimate TOTS card than, um, than we would if they just gave us those regular league upgrades. So I'm not complaining about these packs though. Um, they're still pretty good. And what I want to compare today is we're going to do a little video comparing the two types of packs. The 82 plus um, single card upgrade SBC and the 80 plus player pick. So I have 15 of each of these. We have 15 of the 80 plus rare players packs. And then you can't, I obviously can't go show you because the store is blocked right now since I have unassigned items. But I also have 15 of the 82 plus guaranteed packs. So we're gonna rip these packs here really fast. We're gonna go for the 80 plus packs first. And I just wanna kinda do this for you guys because as you are working on these packs throughout the week, if you're doing some of these upgrade SBCs, we gotta find which ones are the most OP and are the best. So we're gonna rip through these 15 um, player picks starting off the bat with a pretty solid one in the 84 rated Felipe Anderson. Um, so we're gonna rip through these and kinda compare the results and see what we get. Goodness gracious, this is uh, starting off pretty good. 284 rated from the prim. We're gonna zip through these. I don't have like anything in the club like right now, so there shouldn't be too many duplicates. All my golds have been, yes, a blue, let's go. 85 rated Rui Silva. I mean, it's not a card that I'm gonna use, but that's a perfect untradeable TOTS card for the guaranteed that's a TOTS SBC that could be coming out today. Boom, that's a blue boys, four packs in and we get a blue. Obviously it's not an ultimate TOTS blue. But it's a blue. We will absolutely take it. Another 84 rated Payette. Dude, these 80, the 80 plus player picks are freaking rigged. Look at all those 84s. Ridiculous. Oh, Scov, let's go. That man's a beast. That's my second blue with like six of these. Oh my goodness. Three star, three star, high, low work rates. This card is incredible. I've seen a lot of people talk about this card. He doesn't have the jumping, but everything else looks insane. And what a freaking pack pull. Two blues in like, what, six of these packs? Rui Silva and Skov? All right, pack seven. Let's continue the luck, boys. I think the contest might be over already. I think the contest literally might be over. We've gotten two blues out of eight of these packs so far. Two blues out of eight packs out of the 80 plus uh, one of three 80 plus rare player picks Busquets as well 89 rated let's go although I do think no this is on I have a tradable version in my club so we're gonna have to switch him out as a duplicate but that's an 89 rated Busquets that is a GG Cramrich as well the, the, these the 80 plus picks these packs are insane man Tiago Silva an 88 rated Wow you're like, yo, why are you getting excited about an 88 rated Tiago Silva? It's one of three 80 plus overall players in the game. There are so many 80 plus players, like 81s, 80s, that are in the game. And I'm getting 88 rated Tiago Silvas. Look at these polls, dudes. Look at this page. 80, I don't have, I don't even have an 81 rated here. 82, I have two, eight, three 82s, an 88, an 84, 89 Busquets, and two Tots cards out of these... And a third Tots card in Vanekin. Let's go. What is going on? This card's got the five-star week for the four-star skills. High, high work rates. I bet he feels a bit clunky, though, with his agility and balance and the fact that he is six foot five. So that's interesting. But we'll take it. A third Tots card for the club. What can we get in this last and final pack? Rakitic. Dude, these packs are insane. The competition is over. This competition is over. I'm ki This is ridiculous, man. This is ridiculous. Look at the pack pulls that we just got from all this. 88 rated Thiago Silva, 89 rated Busquets, three Tots cards, and some 84s as well, and Rakitic. Get them all in the club. Let's go see if the 82 plus cards 
can top this. So this is just going to be one player that is 82 plus rated. We want to see some walkouts because if you think about it, from those last packs, basically what we saw was Scov. We had three team of seasons, which would have been walkouts. Oh, David Alaba, that's pretty solid. We would have had three team of the seasons that were walkouts. We would have had Busquets as well. That's four. We would have had Rakitic, and we would have had Thiago Silva. So we got six walkouts, basically, from those 80-plus player picks. We need to get a similar amount of walkouts from these to, to even start to think about that these packs are going to be worth it compared to those. But, man, I cannot believe the pack luck on those 80-plus packs, man. The 80-plus player picks, I think those are the move, honestly. We haven't got a walkout yet any out of any of these SBCs. It is a board player, though, in our third 82-plus. It's going to be a Brazilian center back, Marquinhos, 85 rated. So I've gotten two boards so far, and they've both been 85 rated. So that's good. That's pretty good. Let's keep going with these. 82-plus. Let me guy, Let me know you guys down in the description which ones have worked best for you because I've heard some people say that the 82s have been the best for them some people have said that the 80s have been the 80 plus picks have been the best for them so I'm curious to see what you guys had to think about that but for for me it's obvious to tell that uh, oh we get a walker right here can it be a blue it is a blue let's go boys please be an ultimate tots Italian striker quietly real oh Donnarumma Donnarumma will take it though that's an 89 rated Tots card, man. What is going on with my pack luck this evening? We packed four blues. I need to update. The, I haven't even updated the Tots counter. We packed four blues. 62 blues, boys. Donnarumma is in the club as an untradeable Tots card. This is ridiculous. All right, so the 82 plus packs want to make a name for themselves. This fight isn't over yet. Pretty nice card. But that is our first walkout out of these 82 plus packs. Let's see if they keep giving out. Let's see if they keep giving out. This one's not a walkout. It is a board though. What do we need in this one? Who's this going to be? Uh, Strutman, 83 rated. All right, another 83 rated for the club. I was really hoping that that blue was going to be uh, one of the ultimate tots cards. Donnarumma is not an ultimate tots. He's in the lower league, uh, but that would have been sick. I just want to see that walkout symbol again ever since we've been catching it. Um, ever since the big pull so far, I want to see the walkouts. Portugal center mid from Benfica, Pizzi. 83 rated card. Pretty solid as well. Um, but of course, as I said before, let me know down below or tweet me pictures on Twitter if you've gotten some good cards from this SBC. We're going to keep ripping through the packs. We have seven to go. This one's not a walkout, unfortunately. But it is a board. It is a board. Belgium right wing Thorgan Hazard. That one's going to be Thorgan Hazard. Man. I think the 80 plus picks are the move, boys. And based on my pack luck in those first few, I'm going to be hammering those all week. That's for sure. Maybe we'll throw in a few of these 82 plus because, you know, they are a little bit cheaper to complete. You only, you only need... Five rares, and we, we get Glick there. You only need five rares for this SBC, but I'm really thinking that the uh, the player pick is just juiced. From what I've seen on Twitter, from what I've seen, obviously from my own polls, it uh, it seems to me like the 80 plus is, is the rigged one, but we do get a walkout in this 82 plus. It is a blue. Let's go. Show me Belgium? Cam? Who's this? Oh, it's a dupe. That is a duplicate Vanekin, boys. That is a duplicate Vanekin Tots card. So I'm really starting to wonder if it's really, really common to pack these Tots cards out of uh, these upgrades, the lower level Tots. I'm, I'm torn on what to do with here, boys. I could go do an SBC, but I don't have that many high rated golds in the club. Um, I'm, I'm actually, I'm just going to get rid of this one. It's not that many coins. I have 13 million. It's okay. Don't hate me, boys. <laughs> I know somebody's not going to like that. It's okay. I just don't want to take the time to go craft at the moment. We're going to keep ripping through these packs, though. I'm sure I'll pack him again. From the looks of it, I'm going to continue to pack some of these cards. As I'll, I'll be doing upgrades throughout the rest of the week, probably uh, tonight on stream, on Tuesday, Tuesday evening on stream. You'll see me doing these because, uh, yeah, these, these, packs, these packs seem to be pretty rigged. 
We have a few more left. Let's see if we can get another walkout out of these last couple packs. We have gotten two blues, so if we get one more blue, we would match the same number of blues that we got from the um, from the 80 plus player pick SBC. So we have three packs to go. Let's see if we can uh, hit another blue or a walkout or both in these last couple packs. Not in this one. It is a board player though. Who's it going to be? It's, uh, Spanish striker Bilbao. It's going to be Adoriz. Send that to the club. But man, I'm pumped to get Skov. I'm pumped to get um, Donnarumma. Those cards will be fun to try out. I'll probably use them and probably eventually throw them into to an SBC as well. No walkout here. We do get a board though. We do get a board. Who's it gonna be? Don't be Strootman. It's gonna be DeVridge. 84 rated. So still, out of these 82 plus packs, if you can't decide which ones to do, for me, it's gotta be the 80 plus player picks. They do cost a little bit more, but they only cost like seven to eight K per SBC. You can you can bid on those cards, honestly. Get on your bids for the rare golds. You get those cards for a little bit cheaper. Quadrado, nice. He's kind of a rare card to pack. You don't see him get packed that often. Um, but you can do this SBC for like seven to eight thousand coins by bidding on all of the rare golds that you need, and um, and yeah, you should be able to do to do those pretty easy. But man, what a freaking pack opening in terms of um, the the cards that we got from those eighty plus packs. Dude, that was ridiculous. Even some of the ones that we got, we got Donnarumma. Um, Couple 84s, uh, Alaba, Marquinhos, Vanekin, we got him twice, the Rakitic, the Thiago Silva, and the Sergio Busquets. The Skov, I'm, I'm really pumped to try out Skov as well. But I'm going to be hitting these packs for the rest of the week based on what I got from those. Um, one last simple note, if you guys are looking to trade, if you're not looking to trade, if you guys are looking to buy some players for your weekend league teams, definitely, definitely get on those cards before... Um, before we can leave rewards that's my that's my knowledge that i'm going to pass on to you guys get on those cards before we can leave rewards i think a lot of stuff's going to go up after we can leave just because there's going to be a lot of coins on this market again because of uh, all the rewards that, that are going to be coming out uh this week so good luck on the packs if you're smashing them hopefully my luck inspires you to uh open some of those packs and of course let me know how you do i think the clear winner here is the 80 plus upgrade pick because a it only costs you five more rares, and B, you get a pick between three different players. So instead of just getting one option from the pack, you get three. And it seems like that having those three options is uh, it gives you a pretty high probability of actually getting a pretty juiced pack from what we saw. So I put about 250,000 coins into making those packs tonight, and definitely I made my money's worth. Uh, from those in terms of the high rated cards that we pulled and of course the team of the season cards as well so thank you for watching the video boys if you enjoyed it smash a thumbs up comment down below if you have any questions and subscribe to the channel if you're new it's been nate foot account catch you guys later peace out